Hey everybody, this is Keith K with a long dark fishing tutorial. Uh, before we head out onto the ice, we are going to need to make sure that we've got some fishing tackle to be able to fish with. And um, believe it or not, fishing tackle can start with some fresh guts, which you can get by harvesting uh, frozen deer or deer that you take out on your own, which I'll cover in another tutorial. Um, but in order to fish, we are going to need some fishing tackle, and you build that here at the workbench. Uh, in this case, it happens to be in a um, service station. So you click on to the uh, workbench, and we're just going to flip through here until we find uh, the, the, here we go, fishing tackle. So to make fishing tackle, you need a hook and a line, one of each. Um, and as you can imagine, we're going to show you how to make those because we don't have them. So the first thing we need is to create uh, some line and you need cured guts for that. I happen to have two. So we'll go ahead and craft that. Like everything in the long dark, um, it does take time. And so it burns up some time. Let's go ahead and make another one. <clears throat> you can see we get a little more tired. We burn up some calories. Oh, we're yawning. Uh, the other piece that we need is a hook. And we have two pieces of scrap metal so we actually can craft two hooks. Let's do that. And another one. All right. <clears throat> so now we can go back to our fishing tackle and you can see that we need, uh, we can actually make quite a few here. Let, let's just make one for the purposes of demonstrating it. And then we can leave here. And I'm going to go ahead and put the excess back in um, the drawer here. So let's see. We have a bunch of hooks. We can get rid of those. Let's move them all. A bunch of lines. So I still have fishing tackle here. And you can see um, I've got a couple of fishing tackle. I've got one already. And then lots of hooks and lines that I've built over time. All right. Uh, next, we're going to go out to the ice. For that, I may take a little nap. All right, it's a brand new day, and we're going to head over to our fishing cabin out on the lake. We are headed out that way <clears throat> to that fishing cabin out there. So let's uh, make a jog of it. All right, and here we are. First thing we're gonna do when we get in here is to get a fire lit. Um, as you can see, we've got plenty of time to fish, but uh, one of the things we do wanna watch out for is getting too cold because we will be pretty sedentary in here. All right, so here's our fishing, fishing hut. So we're gonna go inside here. And it looks like there's some food and such on um, that'll help us out if we get hungry while we're here. Ah, uh, some mountaineering rope, that might come in handy. All right, so you can see the uh, ice fishing hole. I was just here recently, it's, um, but these will freeze over. Right now it says 51% frozen. These will freeze over. So what we're gonna do first is get ourselves a fire going. Uh, let's see. Wood matches give you the best um, chances, but I'm going to, oh. We use some accelerant, so I won't need tinder. But we'll actually, what we can do is we can grab this newsprint roll, and uh, we can actually let's take a look here. I think we can make some tinder out of this. Yeah, this will yield four tinder plugs. So let's go ahead and do that. Got plenty of time. So, we'll open the pot belly stove here. We've got a tinder plug, um, and we'll use some accelerant just to make sure we can get this going. And that's going to give us an hour and 38 minutes of uh, fire, which should keep us nice and warm while we're in here fishing. So let's go ahead and click on the ice fishing hole, and you can either use your hunting knife or your hatchet to crack open the ice. So let's break the ice. And you can see it is taking time, it's using up calories. 
Yeah, you know, it is changing our temperature. So let's choose ice fishing hole. If we click on this, we can start fishing. Um, and I'll go with about three hours of fishing. Now the fire will run out. Oh, got a tr one rainbow trout, which we can cook. And as you fish, you may catch one or more as the time goes by. And that's about it. I guess that's all it's going to give us. Oh, we used up our tackle. Uh, so your tackle will wear down over time. Let's see. Yeah, we used up our tackle. Uh, I'm not used to it going so fast. I don't know if they changed something recently, but uh, that's pretty much fishing. Uh, let's see. We've still got a few minutes in here. Let's see if we can actually get this cooked up. Here's our rainbow trout raw. Let's see if we have enough time to cook it. And we've got one cooked rainbow trout and some lamp oil. You will get lamp oil from fish, which is great. A great way to replenish the oil for your lanterns. So that's a quick tutorial. Uh, obviously, if you want to be out here longer, you're going to need to bring a little more tackle and spend a little more time here. But uh, at this point, you get the gist. And fishing is a great way to not only get yourself some food here, uh, but also a great way to get some lamp oil to replenish your lantern if you aren't finding enough right there. All right, so that's it. If you enjoyed this tutorial, uh, please like and consider uh, subscribing. And let me know if you're interested in seeing more of the long, dark tut tutorials. And I'll see you back here soon. Thanks a lot.